what's up guys and welcome to today's video i am not feeling well you can probably hear it in my voice my sinuses the pressure the headache body aches i got a flu shot earlier this week and i'm thinking that that is contributing to this um and also it's been raining and then nice weather and then cold then i spent all day at a lantern festival so i need to just like boost up my immune system and i'm not at home I am in a different place. So I wanted to just share with you guys what I do in order to feel better. And hopefully by tomorrow night, I will be feeling 100% my bet, 100% myself because I do have plans this week to go to Chicago and see my family, my friends. So ignore the honey that burst in the car somehow. Um, I got some bone broth, some organic bone broth and it's chicken flavored. So I'm gonna start off by cooking that. Next on the list is to get some tea going as well. Tea check. I have eight seconds left. See that steam? Mm-hmm. Let me wash my hands. When you're sick, washing your hands is key. Wash your hands often, more often than you normally would. And obviously drinking lots of water is key. So right here I have this is the Walmart brand for medicine. And I have both the night and the morning one. It's closer to night than it is morning, but it's still three and I don't want to be drowsy yet. So I'm going to take the morning ones. The only thing I hate about these pills is how big they are. Like that, that's huge. That's a huge pill. I don't have problems with pills, but like, why? Why do they have to be so big? Why can't you just have me take three smaller ones? Like if I'm not feeling well, make sure you think that I'm comfortable just swallowing these huge pills. I just don't get it. Do you get it? I don't get it. But I digress. So I'm gonna take these pills and get my tea started. I also bought some Theraflu. I personally love Theraflu. I think that it's great. It usually always helps me. So I got the multi-symptom severe cold one. They have different types, but this one is the green tea and green tea and honey lemon flavor, but they also have like an apple cinnamon one. It tastes like apple cider. It is so good. So I'm gonna have one of these closer to tonight because sometimes they do make you a little drowsy. And I already had the apple cinnamon one at home. Like I told you, I'm not buying a whole bunch of expensive medicines because I already have a whole bunch at my place. So I'm gonna get me a cup of water and then we're gonna take this medicine and our bone broth should be done as well. So. Let's just get started. I'm typically a lukewarm, room temperature type of girl, but right now I'm gonna have something a little bit more cold. So I'm gonna have a few ice cubes in my water. In my water, I'm also gonna add some lemons, some fresh lemons. You can use lemon juice if that's what you have. And then the rest I'm gonna put in my tea. Here's what our bone broth is looking like. It's nice and hot. So I'm just going to turn off the flame and let it simmer for just a little bit longer before we transfer it over to the bowl. So I have my water here and my medicine. I'm gonna mark the time to make sure that I'm not overtaking any medications and then I'm taking them as they're prescribed or supposed to be taken. So it's 3.46 right now. Next, let's get our tea going. Tea is great when you are not feeling well. It has a lot of like natural healing properties. 
so I like to add a lot of honey. Um, and even when my throat is really sore, I will take honey and lemon and put it on a spoon and take it just like that. And I'm telling you, you get like immediate relief. So if you haven't tried that, try that. Just black tea that I'm having. I'm gonna let that steep for just a little bit before I drink it, make sure it all gets in there and wash my hands again. I am going to take in this bone broth, have my tea, and drink as much water as I can today to clear out those toxins. Lemon juice will help with that in the water and also my tea. And I'm just gonna have bone broth probably for the rest of the day. Has a lot of like good natural healing properties as well. I'm not saying it's like the most delicious thing because it's not. Yeah, I'm just gonna have this and I'll check back in with you guys in a little bit. So guys, I know that I have on another thing. It's the same day, I promise you. Um, and you can see my other jacket's over there. But um, I was filming a video, so I just changed jackets because this is brighter. Finishing up that carton of bone broth. I'm about to take the night time cold and flu relief. And I'm also gonna do a TheraFlu. I don't know if you're supposed to mix it. I'm not a doctor, guys. I'm not telling you that these are for sure straight remedies and this will help you feel better. Always talk to your doctor. Make sure that you're not allergic to anything, that you don't have any allergies to any of the medications. Um, ask your doctor what works best for you. Ask your parents, um, maybe someone who's this is what helped me, okay? That's all I'm trying to say. This is what's helped me. I haven't had any allergic reactions or any issues with this stuff. So just always check with your doctor or a primary care doctor or an urgent care. Maybe they have something better for you. But I'm gonna make a TheraFlu and also take the nighttime one. I kept a daytime one so that I can take it in the morning. It's 10 o'clock on the dot. So yeah, let me hurry up. Then I'll show you guys what I do next to feel better. out of the shower I usually take hot showers or a hot bath most likely hot showers when I'm not feeling well and it usually helps like clear up the congestion or a cough or a headache you know a shower just does something magical so um, I wanted to do this Neutrogena Hydro Boost mask with hydrogel I mean it doesn't help but it'll make me feel better <laughs> And I know that like I've been using a lot of tissue, I've been sneezing a lot, so I want to, oh snap, it's spilling. I want to just like give my face some extra TLC. Okay guys, so I'm gonna finish my nighttime routine which is brushing my teeth I always brush my teeth when I'm not feeling well sometimes multiple times in the day if I'm especially if I'm at home just because you don't want to keep any of those nasty germs in your mouth I also have a tongue scraper that I use that's been very helpful it gets all those extra germs to stay on your tongue out thanks so much for watching guys I'm just about to cozy up next to some heat and finish my TheraFlu and go to bed. So this is what I typically do to make sure that I am taking care of myself. I make sure I get lots of rest, that I take things slow, that I don't overdo it, that I'm not out in the elements too much, especially when I don't have the proper clothes or wear like gear to wear outside. So make sure that I'm covered up nicely. And yeah, 
that's what I do. Thanks guys for watching the video.